All right, what's up everyone? My name is Will Cashin, AKA White Trash Willie. Um, some of you guys know me from Undialed TV or know me from my Instagram or we're gonna learn some scooter tricks today and that is the main focus. So today, I'm gonna teach you how to backside lip slide. Now backside lip slides were kind of a tricky trick for me at first, but now it's one of my favorite tricks and I'm gonna give you a few little tips on how to do it. So first, I'm gonna tell you what a backside lip slide is and how it's different from a frontside lip slide because I know a lot of you experienced riders know, oh, it's so common sense, you do not know the difference, but for you less experienced riders, I'm gonna show you what a backside lip slide actually means. So the difference between frontside and backside is literally what side the obstacle is when you approach it. So, if I'm approaching something, on my front side, that would be whatever front side trick it would be. So it could be a front side board, it could be a front side lift, it could be a front side 50-50. If it's on your front side and you do a grind, it's a front side trick. Now, if it's on your back side, when you're approaching it, see, back side. Now, if you do a board, back side board. If you do a back lip, backside lip. If you do a back 50-50, backside 50-50. So I'm not here to teach you frontside lip slides or anything like that. I'm here to teach you backside lip slides. So now that you know you have to approach the rail on your backside, what is a lip slide? So a lip slide is basically when you're on one side of the rail and you jump over the rail to the other side. A backside lip because it's on my backside and I'm doing a lip because I'm going over the rail. The tricks that you probably want to know to do a backside lip slide, basically just a board slide and I would say a front board slide and a suicide front board. And that isn't like a requirement, but it really, really, really helped me out. The reason you need to know how to do a board slide is it's the same side of the rail as you're gonna do a back lip. So you just gotta be comfortable being able to like approach a rail with the rail on your backside. The reason you want to know a front board is because you are doing a front board in a back lip. A front board is when you grind like this and grind through, and a back lip is literally hopping over the rail into a front board. So you hop over the rail into a front board. I would say get good at front boards first, uh, just so you're like comfortable enough that you can just grind like, I don't know, like a little bit. All right, so I said previously in the video, I talked about a suicide front board. And basically what I mean by a suicide front board is it's not a board that's killing itself. It is literally a um, board slide where you jump directly straight onto the rail. Now the reason this will help you is because it'll help you practice just jumping like onto the rail from not just like the side position. It helps you like just jumping onto it like from a like a straight on. So that way when you go to a back lip, it basically feels like the same tricks. So that way you can kind of like take your front boards and like slowly inch your way into a back lip. Um, I'm gonna show you what it looks like real quick. All right, so I'm going up the rail and you notice that I'm literally gonna jump onto the rail like straight onto it, like I'm not gonna go to either side. So the reason this helps you, it's kind of like a back lip just because kind of like jumping over the rail, but at the same time you're not jumping over the rail. It's just a little trick that's like in the middle of a front board and a back lip and it really helped me learning back lips. When you feel comfortable with front boards and you're good with that, basically, all that you're gonna need to do to do a back lip is jump over the rail. So jumping into back lip, I know I'm just, I keep saying, yeah, you just gotta jump into it, but jumping into it is not actually that easy. Like it is once you learn it, but at first it can be kind of tricky. So here's like some techniques that I found to like help me get onto the rail easier. So you're coming at the back lip, you're mobbing, you're cruising, and you gotta somehow get from this position into this position. Now the easiest way that I've found to do this is to is to bunny hop like, like you're hopping over something really high. When I jump over something really tall, I do this. I jump and then I literally like tweak my deck in the air so I can get as high as I can. And I kind of think of a back lip like the same way. So you basically what you want to do is you want to jump the height of the rail and then kind of like tweak it over. I found that's the easiest way because if I just jump directly in a back lip, sometimes I go and I just jump and I go and I like hit the back of my deck not really on this like tiny, tiny rail, but I just mean on like taller things. Um, another thing is to get like a smaller rail to practice this on. The smaller the rail, the easier it's gonna be to jump into it, and the more it's gonna feel like just a front board, so it'll make it a little bit easier for you to learn it. So all in all, basically what you're doing is you're just approaching the rail, jumping up, tweaking your body, landing in 
you, your comfortable front board position and then just grinding off the rail. Um, back lips are a super, super fun trick. I'm just teaching you on rails right now, but if you want to do on coping, it's basically like the same type of thing. Um, a back lip is like, it's a super, super, super like good trick to have because you can do it like on lots, lots, of lots of different obstacles. You can do it on ledges, you can do it on rails, you can do it on quarter pipes, you can do it on cars, you can do it on anything that you want. Hopefully you guys enjoyed this tutorial on how to back lip. Um, if you guys want to see other tutorials, just drop a comment down below and I might do it on the district channel. So thanks for tuning in. Thanks for watching guys. And I'll catch you guys later. Peace out.